Hey, football fans, Brad Nessler here with my partners in crime, Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreit. No complaints about the weather tonight as we see nothing but stars in this contest between the Rice Owls and the Texas Longhorns. There's going to be some exciting NCAA action here. It just seems like this season's getting more and more intense with each week. And here come the Longhorns. The Longhorns are a confident bunch of kids, and rightfully so. Kirk, this team is just too powerful. Texas is anchored up front on defense by one of the best tackles in the nation. His ability to disrupt things drives coaches crazy. I think he'll dominate again today in a big win. Nice pick, Kirk. There's no way Texas loses this game. Pick them horns. I just got to wonder, where do you get those things? Helmets, mascot heads? I mean, every game is something Texas new. Texas is ready to open this one up as they line up for the opening kick. Kicks it off. Sears takes it at the eight. Lucky if you can even get past the 50, let alone find the end zone. Looks under pressure, and down he goes. They get to the quarterback and end that play before it even got started. This young man didn't even have a chance to make something happen. It's tough to find your receivers when the defense is in your face like that. Daniel, back to throw. He throws it, and it's caught. He might have a chance. And he shoved out of bounds. Daniel sets up the play action. Finds a man. Tackle. Nice decision by the quarterback. Not only was it good decision making, but the offensive line protected. He juked him out of his shoes. Bounces off the would be tackler. And down he goes. Nice game for the halfback. That time they kept it on the ground with the counter play. The blocking was great up front. Daniel, back to pass. Throws it to the outside. And he came down with it. What a catch. The wide receiver flew down the field on that touchdown connection. But he has the speed to stretch the defense, and his hands are getting better every single game. He drops back. Across the middle. It's dropped. Oh, he could have had a big reset. Edmund is back in the gun. Back to pass. Looking. Throws. And it's going the other way. Touchdown, Texas. Oh, boy. I bet he knew as soon as he released that football that he should have made the throw. That's the thing. When you're under that kind of pressure, it takes away that one split second you need to scan the areas to know where it's a safe throw. And that's why a pass rush is so crucial. Daniel drops back to pass. He's going left. Hoffman drops the ball. Dropped by the wideout. He drops back. He steps up. He spins around. No one opens, so he's going to run. Love Lady with a takedown. He made a real nice play on that one. I'll tell you what. In today's game, you have to have the ability to run the football. Give the quarterback a lot of credit. He made a great play and really gave his team a boost. He lobs it right side. Complete. Broke away from one. Brought down. Way to look it in. Nice kick. They'll run the option. He's hit and got away. Love Lady with a takedown. Nice running on the option there. That was a spectacular option keeper there. And I'm going to tell you why. It looked like that play was going nowhere, but this quarterback made the right choice by holding on to the football. You're right. Good heads-up play there by the QB. A long ways yet to go, but at the end of one, our score, Texas, 14, Rice, nothing. Daniel on the option left side. Juku. Touchdown, Longhorn. This quarterback just knows how to find the end zone, coach. And I'll tell you what, he's got a lot of good here, but he can use his wheels. That guy can run. Alvarez, ready to kick. Decent kick, looks to be returnable. Sears, passing at the five. Little juke. 
And he puts it on the turf. It's scooped up. Daniels comes to the line with three wide. They'll throw on first down. He can scoop. Mayo brings him down. He rolls left. He's looking. Across the middle. And it's caught for the touchdown. Oh, my. When it rains, it pours. Ha, that's why I bought one of these. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Watch it, coach. You're going to take an eye out. Put that thing away. Like Brad said, when it rains, it pours. I came prepared, my friend. Very funny, Coach. Now, seriously, can you close that thing off so we can see the game? What? Allen drops the throw. Steps up. He's got to throw it in a hurry. Henry comes away with a sack. The quarterback had nowhere to go, and he's brought down for the sack. Drops back to pass. He steps up, looking. They'll make the sack. Now that's some heavy pressure. It all starts with the battle up front. I don't care how good your receivers are or how explosive your running backs are. If you can't control the line of scrimmage, then it's tough to move the football. I agree, coach. And the thing is, this quarterback can... He's on the run. Mayo with a takedown. Here comes the pressure. And he's going to come up with a sack. Under relentless pressure, the quarterback goes down for the sack. Daniel, back to throw. He's looking. Throws it out there. And it's incomplete. And this one could be on the defense. Pass interference on the defense. 15 yard penalty. Well, the offense is helped out by that defensive penalty. You bet they are. That's an easy way to pick up yards. Daniel on first down. Throws down the middle. He breaks free. The 10. And he will score. And for the third time in this first half, they've managed to find the end zone through the air. And this quarterback gets in rhythm. Watch out. This could be a ugly. Starts this drive at the 18. He jukes him. He's on the run. Missed tackle. And he's taken down. He's back in the gun. Back to pass. Steps up in the pocket. Looking. He's under pressure. And they get the sack. What do we have, Lee? We have sack number four today. This defense came to play, and I love it. After one half of play, this one is not even close. Our score, Texas, 35. Rice, not. Drops back to pass. Throws short. Got some open field. Jake's off a tackle. Across midfield. At the 40. At the 30. To the 20. To the 10. Goodbye. Talking to their coach during the week, he felt they would be able to exploit that defense, especially in the secondary. And boy, was that an understatement. That's the fourth time they beat them in the air for a touchdown. This is the kind of running back who can make you pay when he's in the zone. They go with a run. Can't wrap him up. Bryant with a takedown. And that was a nice run. Kirk, that was a great job by that big offensive line. Yeah, it really was, Brad. Back to pass. Steps up in the pocket. He's looking. Pressure coming. They'll make the sack. That gives this defense five sacks on the day. He steps up. He takes off. Got some open field. And he's tackled. He made a real nice play on that one. I'll tell you what. In today's game, you have to have the ability to run the football. Play action. Finds a man. Tackle at the 41. 
I like the defense that was called. They just couldn't make the play on the ball. You're right. It wasn't necessarily bad defense. The offense just executed, and the result is a first down. Three wide. Up the middle. Brought down. And that was an excellent run there. Yeah, Brad, but it was also great blocking up front by the offensive line to open up the hole. Unless we see some sort of miracle, this one's pretty much over. Heading to the fourth. Our score, Texas, 42. Rice, nothing. He drops back. Steps up. Throws. Incomplete pass. He had his wide out, but he couldn't hit him. When he misses, it's usually hot. He gets it up. And it's right down the middle. This drive summary is brought to you by Plumbing. Willis pitches out to the right. Throws it to the outside. It falls incomplete. You got to be careful when you call it. They come out in a nickel. Under heavy pressure. Throws to the middle. Got him on the run. They'll bring him down. It's another. Back to pass. He steps up across the middle. Got it. Tackle. Move those sticks. That's a first down. And a great catch, too. Did you see how he looked that one in? Play action. Rolls to the right. Across the middle. Touchdown, Texas! Well, at this point, these guys are just out there patting stats and running up the score. Sometimes you play in a game and you can't do anything wrong. You find yourself in a rhythm or a zone. This whole team seems like they've been in a rhythm since we kicked this game off. The Owl set up in the gun. Edmund drops back. He's going left. And it's picked off. And the defense comes up with another one. Hey, good job by that defense to get the ball back. The gives to the fullback. A little juke. There's a missed tackle. And he has room to rumble. The 10. Palmer with a takedown. How do you like that run? I'll tell you what. If you're the defensive coach, you don't like it at all. In fact, you're probably disgusted. No doubt. That big fullback made his defense look bad on that play. Keep it on the ground with a tailback. Touchdown, Texas! And they just continue to pour it on out there. I'll tell you what, this has been a tremendous effort all game long. What a performance. This is one team that's been extremely well prepared. These young men... They'll bring in their dime package. Drops back to pass. Steps up, looking. Rolls right. With the throw. Picked off by the linebacker. He breaks free. Touchdown, Texas! What is going on here, guys? They've just been outplayed and outcoached out there. Anything and everything is going on today, Kirk. There's not much else you can do except pack it up and try again next week. Back to pass. He steps up. Across the middle. Batted ball. Caught. And he's brought down. That's just airing it out on third down. That was more than enough to pick up the first down. Next time, this defense will be playing on their heels. it deep downfield the senior makes the catch wow they convert on fourth and long on that pass play Kirk guys you just don't see this happen very often fourth and a mile the receiver comes up with a big play and the defense is caught off guard for the first down Comes to the line with three wide. Edmund set to go to the air. And it's intercepted in the end zone. He tries to spin. Brought down. Make that the fourth interception on the day for this defense. I said it before, and I'll say it again. This secondary is one of the best in the United States. No doubt about it. They're very athletic and are also well coached.
And this ball game's over. Coach, what's your final thought on the game? I can't say enough about this performance. Texas looked like a team on a mission to destroy anything and everything that got in their way. Brad, this is a really good-looking football team. Well, that'll wrap up another chapter in NCAA Football 2006. And our final count, Texas 66, Rice nothing. Brad Nessler for Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreit signing off. So long, everybody.